Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be budgeting for the second half of April. Um, I usually do bi-weekly budgets and I'm gonna open this up here. I'm gonna be budgeting from April 12th all the way to April 29th. So I'm gonna do two weeks plus a couple more days because this is a pay stretch for us um, or like a longer pay period. So I just wanna keep that in mind while I budget. And if you guys don't know, my husband has already deployed. He has to get like situated over there so he'll have to like buy certain things and um, also he's able to get some Wi-Fi. So we're gonna be able to talk to each other. I'm gonna have to put that in the budget as well. So for this budget, I am using the Caffeinated Kate's April budget kit. So I recently lost this, but it turned out I accidentally like um, kicked it under the couch in my son's room. So, oh my gosh, I'm so excited to use this kit. I was like super bummed that I lost it, but I'm so glad I found it now so I can use it this time. It is so cute. The purple, oh my gosh. Ugh, I love that. It just looks so, so nice. And then I have the April budget sticker. Okay, so first things first, um, I'm gonna put down income. I kinda wanna decorate it, make it look cute. And the pay will be different now that he is deployed, um, but the thing is, I don't know what that pay is gonna look like, so I'm just gonna budget for like what we usually see, which is about 14, um, 72 and 48 cents. Okay, and now um, that's about it. I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the um, bills here. So for the bills, so the first thing is um, my husband said that he can purchase like Wi-Fi or something like that over there. And then he said it's about, I think $60. And then um, I have my um, cell phone bill due and that's about 160, but this might change because we just uh, suspended his line, but I'm not too sure how low it will go. So I'm just gonna put 160 because I don't know, I just wanna be prepared. And then um, I have my Chase card, my last consumer debt that I'm tackling um, while he's deployed and that's about 180. And then that's about it. Um, I will be writing on the side here, like the actual amounts as well as whether or not I paid it off and I'm gonna use this sticker here, kind of mark like right here. I usually write like the actual amounts and then I check it off as I like pay it off. That's it for bills. And now I'm going to um, put down savings. I do sinking funds. So I am saving for gifts, like 60 bucks. And then for household items, I'm still pretty much good on household items. So I usually save about $20. And then lastly, my subscriptions, which include like Amazon, Netflix, HP Inc. That's about $25. Now moving on to living expenses. Since it's only gonna be me, I'm budgeting for food, 175. Um, usually I budget like $200, um, so like $100 per week. And instead of doing like $150, I decided to do $175 because it is a pay stretch and I have to account for the extra days until we receive the next paycheck. And then for gas, um, still budgeting $150. I don't think I'll be going out that much. The only time I'll be going out is for Easter. So I'll be out of town for Easter. Oh my gosh, I didn't even write my label. And then next, for my husband, we're actually giving him an allowance, I guess, while he's overseas. For this paycheck, we have decided on an allowance of $100. We did decide on about like $200 a month, so I'm just gonna save him like $100 each paycheck. That should be like more than enough. I don't think he'll be like buying like crazy things while he's over there, so. And then next, personally for me, I always budget like $100 for miscellaneous because sometimes there are things that I don't remember to budget for, so I just put like, kind of like a buffer in a way of $100. And then lastly, Easter, I'm budgeting about like $70 because I'm gonna be out of town. I just wanna make sure I have some money and I think that is it. So now I'm gonna do the total. And the total comes out to 1,100 
dollars. So that means I can actually throw the rest towards my chase card. So I'm going to make a note of that. I'm just going to write about $300 towards chase. And yeah, that should be it. I like to put a washi at the bottom because I think it looks cute and ties the whole budget together. And that is my budget for the second half of April. I think this is like personally my favorite kit so far. It is so pretty. I love the floral. I love the purple and pinks. I think this is super cute. Yeah, if you guys have any questions for me and my budget, be sure to leave me a comment down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. All right, bye guys.